serves as representation for black women looking to pursue a career in law. 12 News' Caroline Reinwald reports Wisconsin has plenty of room to improve its legal diversity. Serving as the first black woman on the Wisconsin Court of Appeals, the Honorable Maxine White says Ketanji Brown Jackson's Supreme Court confirmation made her proud of where the country is today. That to me gives me more hope too, that more people will look beyond a number of things and see the qualifications are there and recognize them for what they are. Getting emotional remembering Jackson's tribute to the first black woman federal judge, Constance Baker Motley. So when she mentioned her, I just started to cry because I was so familiar with one of the people that she credits with giving her the strength, the energy, and the wherewithal, just keep going. Although Velar Phillips became Wisconsin's first black female judge serving on Milwaukee Circuit Court more than 50 years ago, black women are still underrepresented in Wisconsin law. According to the Wisconsin court system, six black women serve as judges statewide. At UW Law, black women make up 2% of their student population. The American Constitution Society grades Wisconsin's legal diversity an F. The legal profession is notably not diverse, and so it's something that the more representation you see, I think the more uh, of a pipeline you'll create for individuals that may be interested. We have to be out there, we have to be doing the mentorship, um, and we have to have a, a fair shot. What was your reactions to today's SCOTUS confirmation? For people who are not used to seeing themselves um, at some of these high positions, I keep talking about you know having a seat at the table, some of the, the highest court at the land, I, this is amazing. I mean, it really, it feels surreal. I asked both those attorneys who were previous presidents of the Wisconsin Association of African American Lawyers why more black women aren't going into law. They told me one big reason is how expensive law school is may not be attainable for everyone, especially black women and women of color. And they tell me that hopefully that'll change as more representation and mentorship opens the doors for everyone. Reporting outside of the Milwaukee County Courthouse, I'm Caroline Reinwald, WYSN 12 News. And Marquette University declined our request for diversity numbers at its law school.